Ain't no need to check the score, bitch, I'ma keep scoring. I get money and go home, bitch, my life boring. Mama want me to quit the lean, but I'ma keep pouring. Got an order, made a 12 gas, look like a leaf roar. Out of town with my bus on, bitch, I'm from Detroit. I got some white boys that really What's it. good, DZ Nation? It's your girl, DZ, and I'm back with another mother-loving video. If you're new to my channel, then I'm your girl, DZ. And if you've been a part of my channel, then you already know what it is. Gang, gang. I'm with the gang. I'm with the heat. Mm, 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 mm. All right, these nations. So, got my drink. Ooh, I just bit the mess out of my tongue. I wanted to come to you guys with. I don't know if y'all been noticing, but but I've been dropping content. Okay. I'm talking about content. It may not be what y'all want to see, but just to let y'all know, I've been dropping it. Some of y'all may not know. This is going to be a completely different video. Um, Some of y'all may not know, but your girl DZ is a low-key, high-key sneakerhead, okay? I got so many pairs of sneakers, it's insane. And I'm like, okay, maybe I should show this side to DZ Nation, you know what I'm saying? Make my, like, show DZ Nation who I really am, you know what I'm saying? Just not about my hair or whatever. But show DZ Nation who I really am. So, I just bought a pair of shoes, okay? Your girl just bought a pair of shoes, okay? Good cop, good cop. Um, I bought these shoes from StockX, uh, probably like a week ago. Now, these shoes are pretty recent, but old at the same time. These are the Air Jordan 1 Lows. Yeah, so these are the Air Jordan 1 Lows Shattered Backboard. So, the reason why I'm doing this video is because I found myself going on YouTube to look up this shoe, okay? I went on YouTube to look up this shoe to see actually how it looked on um looked on feet and things like that. Now, it was some videos and things, but like it was barely any women showing the shoe. And so I'm like, okay, like I want to see how like women will look in this shoe, you know what I'm saying? Cuz just certain shoes look different for men. And that's just how I feel. Now, granted, this is a men's shoe. Yeah, so I'm like, you know what? Let me just go ahead on and do my review coming from a female on this shoe okay on the shoe box it says air jordan ones low white slash black starfish um is the color i usually get my shoes in an eight but what i realize eight when it comes to men's shoes i get my gym shoes my sneakers in a size eight but like if i decided to throw on a thick old nike sock or whatever my feet be like it be the exact size so i decided to go a size up and i actually like the way eight and a half fits so I actually decided that I'm gonna actually start buying my shoes in eight and a half. Just so I can have like a little bit of room in there. So that's what it looked like right there. They gave a standard black Jordan box, you know what I'm saying? Oh my goodness. Bro, I did not know these shoes retail for $90. Um, I'm not entirely sure when these shoes came out. But um I went on StockX and I bought I bought them for $167. Granted, didn't know that they was freaking $90 retail. But then again, this was just a random shoe for me. Now, I have a lot of sneakers like I mentioned. But all my all my shoes are like generic shoes. And when I say generic, I'm talking about I got the Concords. I got the Breads. You know, the Bread 11s. I got the Cool Grays. You know what I'm saying? I got the Jordan 1s. Like, I got all the shoes that people would usually get if they dropped. You know what I'm saying? If that makes sense. I got the Jordan 14s, the 12s, you know what I'm saying? The generic shoes. So what I wanted to do, I wanted to get a shoe with some color, get a different shoe for me. And I feel like this was a perfect shoe. This is my first Air Jordan Lowe's ever, ever. Air Jordan 1 Lowe's, okay? So um, open the box. Here's the, um. if y'all ever purchase anything from StockX, they always send, you know, the welcome letter. From StockX, from the CEO. I like StockX. We got here in time. It lets you know when it was shipped. I mean, when it's coming to you and things like that. StockX sticker. Now, I'm not even going to cap. I got these shoes like two days ago. I opened them. It came in a bigger box, like a bigger regular brown box. But um, I decided to put them on today. All I did was go get some food and come back home, but I couldn't wait. So this is why, like, you know what I'm saying? They're already laced how they laced. 
So here's the shoe. Um, with the stock eggs, um, verified authentic authenticity. I can't say that word. But um, yeah, here's the shoe. Let me explain something to you. I am in love with this shoe. Literally all my shoes are black and red, white and red, white and black, black and white. Some combination of red, black, or white, okay? I do have like two freaky shoes, but this here? Hold on. The orange is suede. The black is suede. The patent leather Nike sign. The wet, the uh, white right here. Hold on. Let's get the detail. Let's not forget the orange bottoms though. Stop playing. And what I really like is the 23 right here. Now like I said, this is my first Jordan 1 low. So I'm not entirely sure if all of them come with the 23 right there. But like, I don't know. It's just something about that that's just like, that just gets me. But um, I did want the high top shatter backboards, the uh, Jordan 1 shatter, but they're just like too much for me right now. I decided like I wanted to go something different. Like I didn't have the lows, so I decided to get the lows or whatever. And this shoe is absolutely fire. If you're, if you're anything like me, love sweatpants, love t-shirts, and things like this, I feel like this shoe is an all-around shoe. Like, this is really about to be my everyday shoe. It's the, I don't, the suede that gets me, bro. The patent leather Nike sign, bro, what? This shoe freaky. But like you can wear this with shorts, skirts, dress, sweatpants, tank top, t-shirt, hoodies, like this is an all-around shoe and I and I love it. And I absolutely love it. Let's go ahead and get one more twirl, okay? On the back you got the um you know the Air Jordan symbol. Not the jump in, but you know the Air Jordan symbol. Let's get the detail though. Verify baby. Suede upper. Whew. Whew. Get into it. As far as the sizing goes, I wear eight and a half men's, um, which is a 10 in women's. Um, I say these shoes are true to size. I mean, if you have Jordans, some people don't have Jordans. So, you know what I'm saying? That's why I'm going over all of this. Some people don't have Jordans. But it's true to size. It's comfortable. Let me see. On the inside, I just got the size eight and a half. Um, got the orange jump man on the inside. And, yeah, if I was to rate this shoe on a scale of one to ten, for me personally, i give it a ten. I just like the suede, I like the orange, I like the black, like I like the 23 right there. That little, the little color, the 23 is what gets me. And now we about to do an on foot, on foot, on feet, on foot, on feet review, whatever, however you say it. So let's get to it.
don't need to check the score, bitch, I'ma keep scoring. I get money and go home, bitch, my life boring. Mama want me to quit the lean, but I'ma keep pouring. Got a